Go ahead, Mr. George. Well, this morning, about 8 o'clock, there was a monster white shark right out there eating something. I don't know what it was eating. It'd get it and throw it. And then it'd go back under and get it and come back up and throw it again. It was out there about 200 yards. About 200 yeah. yards. Yeah. Huh? I sat here and watched it five, ten minutes. They've been here for thousands of years coming through these waters. They just now noticing that. Bottom. Sir, I've been living here all my life. I surfed all my life. It never bothered me. Sharks. And it's surprising how they're closer to shore than most people think or thought. Who do you surf with? I don't surf. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I like to see them big sharks. I keep the surfers away from us. Uh -huh. <laughs> you can't fish because of them. Bendo, bendo. South Africa's got nothing off no on Northeast Florida. <laughs> we were living at the Cape of Good Hope for weeks and we were getting our asses kicked off Jacksonville. <laughs> you know, that's the truth. There's less sharks here than, than other places we've been. We've been, you know, in Africa, sometimes we're able to catch four or five in a day. Here, I knew from the very get-go that this would be a great success if we caught one in 20 days. How do they navigate? How did this shark, you know, just, where is it going? Why, how? Up there, lived there for a while, like that spot. <laughs> Traveled down over here and now it's here. How, why? Is, are they using the bottom to somehow navigate with their senses? We don't know. Someone had a question? We know when we play in a 20 day expedition that we're gonna run into a lot of challenges with weather. So we're hoping for 10 or 12 days on the water. And the key we found lately, we get out and we meet the kids and who knows, you might be inspiring the next great scientist, the next great ocean advocate. So it's pretty cool to connect all the dots. Hear that beat. Beat, beat for you, Me. beat, see, oh, me. Nobody knows. Okay. I mean, we know we've put tags on there, and that's what led us to here. Mary Lee led us here. Okay. Uh, and now we'll see where Lydia takes us from here. It's beautiful here in, in uh, Jacksonville. Absolutely. Yeah. 